everyone, welcome to Lindark Does Life. This week, I'm checking out Edmonton, Chinatown Dining Week and all of their delicious food deals. My name is Linda Huang and I'm a Canadian blogger and now video blogger sharing about my life. Tune in each week as I do something. <laughs> I'll try things you might want to try, visit places you might want to visit, and eat food you might want to eat. I hope you join me as I do life. Edmonton Chinatown Dining Week runs every January, typically the slowest time of year for the restaurant industry. In Chinatown, streets get pretty empty. Hi, I'm just wondering if I can order your Chinatown Dining Week special? Chinatown Dining Week tries to bring new and old customers to the area during a time when restaurants need it most. From January 13th to 23rd, 2022, participating restaurants offer $10 and or $18 takeout or dine-in deals to entice you to visit. I'm doing takeout for most of my Chinatown Dining Week spots. I got butter chicken from Namaste India. Chinatown is home to so many family-owned restaurants making so much delicious food. Bubble waffles are definitely the best type of waffle. Including my family restaurant, King Noodle House Pho Huang. We've been serving Edmontonians my family's Vietnamese soup, pho, for over 26 years. This week is a great opportunity to try food or places you haven't been to before. Or a great reason to return to an old favorite. Thank you! <laughs> for some, Chinatown Dining Week might be the very first time they even visit the city's Chinatown. Thank you. But once you try the food and meet the people, it definitely won't be your last visit. Here's what I tried this Chinatown Dining Week. I did the $18 deal for $20 worth of items from Shan Shan Bakery. I tried my parents' $18 combo B with the 24, a steak, brisket, and beef balls pho that comes with spring rolls, grilled pork balls, and a Vietnamese iced coffee. I picked up the $10 bubble waffle and bubble tea deal from Tea Bar Cafe. And I picked up Guilin Noodle House's minced pork with pickled vegetable vermicelli soup. Mm, smells so good. I got the $18 butter chicken combo with butter naan from Namaste India. Mmm, butter naan. I also tried Emperor's Palace's combo chow mein and giant simai dumplings. And I ordered Spirit Bistro's $18 chicken salted fish fried rice with hot and sour soup, drink, and spring rolls. Bring out! Last stop for me, the $18 spicy pork bulgogi with veggie pancake from Lee House Korean Restaurant. Chinatown Dining Week has lots of vegetarian options too. So thanks so much for watching this week's episode of Lindork Does Life. I'll put the link to the Chinatown Dining Week menus in the video description and I hope you order some food, try something new, support a small business, and if you're watching this in a different year, then just double check the website for current deals and dates. See you next week! Bye! How hot! <laughs>